Right now, we start with breaking news this morning out of Mali. The company that runs the Radisson Blue Hotel in Mali's capital says assailants have taken 170 hostages in a brazen assault involving grenades. The Brussels-based hotel group said the assailants locked in 140 guests and 30 employees. The army commander there is saying that 10 gunmen stormed the hotel on Friday shouting Allahu Akbar or God is great in Arabic before firing on the guards and taking hostages. The U.S. and French embassies asked their citizens there to take shelter where they are in the capital of Bamako. Following a military coup in 2012, Islamic extremists took control of northern Mali, prompting a French-led military intervention in early 2013. The extremists were then scattered from northern towns and cities through the north remains uh, insecure. Uh, militant attacks have extended south this year. And now people are questioning whether this is a direct tie to the actions in Paris. French influence there being that Mali is a former French colony leads you down that road. Of course, uh, the experts will have a lot more to say on that coming up on the Today Show at 7 o'clock.